you look after this a decision by the Supreme Court which has evoked the suspension of 12 BJP Maharashtra MLA? We totally welcome uh, the decision of the Supreme Court. I think this uh, this decision is a, is a tight slap on the face of MVA government. The decision itself says that uh, the decision to suspend 12 MLAs or the resolution to suspend 12 MLAs is illegal, irrational and unconstitutional. I think there can be no more harsh words than what the Supreme Court has expressed. So I think from the day one, I was telling that this decision is totally illegal. It is unconstitutional. Today, I feel vindicated. Uh, so the Maharashtra government is also uh, ruling for an option despite the Supreme Court order because Nawab Malik is saying that the legislative secretary will look after whether the state assembly or parliaments are bound to follow the Supreme Court order. I think uh, it's absolute ignorance which is making him say that. The Supreme Court is above all because Supreme Court is the custodian of the constitution and once a ruling, a judgment is given by the Supreme Court, it's also binding on the parliament. So if this government doesn't follow the ruling of Supreme Court, it will be like breakdown of constitutional machinery situation which I think this government would understand the implications. So what will be the demand of the BJP because the 12 MLA was suspended for more over six months now? Uh, our demand is that government should apologize. Apologize to the constituents of those 12 constituencies whose MLAs were deprived from participating into the proceedings of assembly, also into the proceedings of the committees. So. I think this was totally undemocratic, uncalled for and the MVA government should apologize.